The Mitchell Community College campus has been part of the Statesville community since 1852. It was a women's Presbyterian college back then. It joined the North Carolina Community College system in 1973 and has since added an impressive Mooresville Center. Together, the college and its community form a picturesque setting for some very adventurous activities. This is nothing more than just a test rocket. Um, it's where we actually we can take this payload. The college's rocket team has designed an experimental payload to launch on a NASA rocket. They want to demonstrate how the energy from the rocket's vibrations can be used to create electricity and potentially power the spacecraft. The team built a test table to fine-tune the experiment and demonstrate their idea to NASA for the application. Let's turn this on. So over here, it, uh, it gave you a graph of the actual uh, electrical current uh, voltage that's being made over here, um, the load of ohms, the average output of watts, and the total energy that was created. We start by picking individual components, say a processor, a resistor, a capacitor. For students, the rocket project is an out-of-this-world opportunity to do hands-on design and science. I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do when I came in, and after doing this, I know now exactly what I want to do. And It's just this, designing uh, an electronics circuit board, uh, testing it, going through all the revisions, and then manufacturing it. For Mitchell Community College, the project provides an opportunity for students and departments to collaborate and solve real-world problems. You can see with the rocket, the mechanical engineering team, the machine shop, we all had to pull together and a lot of us found um, some holes in our programs. If, if our students weren't able to do something, that's something that we learned that we had to teach them. The basic instructional philosophy that we have here at Mitchell Community College is based on contextual teaching and learning which basically, in its simplest definition, recognizes that there should be a porous boundary between what goes on in the classroom and what happens in the real world. And our rocketry team is probably one of the best examples of that. You have students who volunteer to develop a project and are competing at a national level. These students take uh, their skills in science, technology, engineering, math, STEM, as we refer to it in the educational world, and apply those in real-world applications and uh, do quite well competing with the university systems and other universities in the, in the nation. The college serves about 12,000 students in its curriculum and continuing education programs combined. There are 24 college transfer programs, 64 degree and diploma programs, ranging from cosmetology and computer science to...